I'm Forrest Pritchard, and I hope you'll enjoy my new book, Growing Tomorrow. My new book tells the story of 18 incredible sustainable farmers from all across the country. It's a story of our national food system, from Cape Cod to the Puget Sound, uh, Minnesota all the way down to Dallas. Told in photograph, story, and best of all, the farmers shared their favorite recipes from their own kitchens. These are our food heroes. These are the farmers who are growing food with passion, with integrity, uh, and growing nutritious, healthy food. These aren't people that are looking for fame or celebrity. Uh, they're doing the hard, honest work. So what a joy to go out and visit these folks, see them behind the scenes, and then share their stories. I want the reader to be able to pick up the book, either read a paragraph or a chapter, take the book straight into the kitchen, cook one of the wonderful recipes, and celebrate the food on your own table. Each farm is represented by uh, two or three recipes. Honey glazed chicken drumsticks from our beekeepers in Dallas, Texas. Raspberries and blueberry parfait from Skagit Valley outside of Seattle, Washington. One of my favorite parts of the book is we have these little fun side brackets. Did you know that the tomato wasn't classified as a vegetable until the Supreme Court decided it in the 1800s? Did you know that you can't create blue cheese around other cheeses because the blue cheese will make all the other cheeses turn into blue cheese? The stories you're gonna find in Growing Tomorrow are stories of real people. They're hopeful, they're positive, they're growing this amazing food. Growing Tomorrow, in such a way that makes it accessible and sensible for all of us to be participants. So the best part of the book, besides the farmers themselves, was working with Molly Peterson, an incredibly talented photographer who's a farmer herself. We'd go to these farms and Molly's just so naturally friendly and talented uh, that she just brought out the best in our subjects. You know, farmers are uh, sometimes uh, very private people. And as you look through the photographs, you can see uh, we didn't have to ask any of the farmers to smile. The smiles came naturally. So as Molly and I traveled around visiting all these very different farms, there was one arching theme. Uh, these people take care of the land. They take care of their animals, their stewards. I mean, is there anything more important than growing healthy, nutritious food for people?